Good morning. We're, this is Steve from Wine Cellar Designers Group. We're very excited to show you this wine cellar in here. Very unique, very amazing uh, components that we put together for this wine room. Look forward to showing it to you. Let's go. Today we're going to talk a little bit about this wine cellar. Really cool attributes and, and things we did for this wine cellar. One thing in particular is using these light panels. Very unique thing that we've that wine cellar designers group has come out with. As well as we also have these alcohol lit up uh, light panels as well. So you put a really good bottle of 1942, a bottle of whiskey, it really lights it up, makes it look really great. Other things we do have is the Wine Cellar Designers Group Triple D Brushed Pegs. Um, those will hold three bottles at a time uh, in a brushed finish. Um, and it, obviously it's being held here by a standoff. So what we do is we stand off those panels about an inch off from the back, holding up those light panels. So it's a light panel sandwiched in with a white acrylic that illuminates that light to be able to show off the bottles that you have here. What we also have here is um, case storage on the right hand side. We have some horizontal displays here for champagnes. Um, we got onto the alcohol lit up panels as well as, and what I would love to do is show you kind of what that would look like as you put that it lights up the bottle. And as you can see here, this is without lighting. So what makes this room so amazing is the light panels that come on, uh, the lighting aspects of the whole thing is what makes this cellar so stunning. The panels are made of it's a light panel sandwiched in with a three-quarter inch white acrylic. And then we CNC the holes to be able to fit the triple deep wine cellar designers group brush pegs. So the light panels basically give it a very, very ultra modern contemporary. It's a very style. ultra modern contemporary design to kind of go with the home here. So let's talk about the cooling unit. So what we installed here is a split system unit from Whispercool. And we, we wanted to have a ceiling mount so it's flush to the ceiling. Um, we put in a Whispercool uh, 8000 ceiling mount unit, which is, has a condensing unit actually up on the uh, roof. And then we then just dropped it right down into the centered into the room. As you can see, it's uh, right now cycled off, but it is um, holding, holding at a temperature of 58 degrees with about 45% humidity. So it's not something you see or notice normally? No, we don't see everything. So when it's flush into the wall, it doesn't affect the, um, the look of the racking or have to be involved in the racking. And as you can see, we put some really good, beautiful marble on the shelf here. So I noticed that it's relaxed. sort of lined up with the black centerpiece, so yeah. it looks like it's part of it. What we wanted to do was center it to be perfectly centered uh, with the cooling unit, with the um, center piece that we have here, um, as well as, you know, as you can see, some of the drawers that we provide, all self-closing drawers and cabinetry. So 
So some of the challenges with this room or this space, if you don't see it now, this, there's the sun that comes into this space almost all day. And so the problem we had, luckily today is a cloudy day, it's a little bit overcast, but what we would have is sun coming right into the glass. And so we were able to refrigerate this room safely without condensation, without any issues, because what we used is a metal frame. We did a, um, a metal framed enclosed, uh, it was a stainless steel uh, glass enclosure. And we did that specifically because of the sun hitting the space. This space cannot have a frameless solution. You can't have frameless glass in this solution because the, the sun would affect that glass and you would, the cooling unit would run a lot longer. Um, it would be running all the time as well as you would have a problem with, um, you know, problem with condensation. So when sun hits the glass, uh, you would create some more heat, which would then have some challenges. So how does having a frame help? So what's great about having that a frame is that you're, you're going to have a better seal. So this is sealed off the room. The refrigeration, the refrigeration unit works significantly better. Um, does it, it works less amount of time and you have that seal to create no condensation, uh, no issues with any wet bottles or anything else.